Okay, here we are at the roach. Yeah. And uh, what we're trying to do here is we're looking at this thing. And you can see that it's not doing a damn thing. Okay. So she's up there in the wind, but not doing a damn thing. And we got a nice breeze coming through here today. It's been all over the place. Just to show you a prime example. Right now it's a little mild breeze, but that thing's been whipping around pretty damn good earlier. Yeah. So here's a good shot. Uh -huh. It ain't doing a damn thing. But right now we're not getting any gusts. See when that's turning at that clip, that's that's not that's a pretty good wind. Especially when it's got snow on it like that. Now this thing just continues to turn into the wind. The pole will even rock back and forth, but the blades don't have enough pitch to them. Near the end they're just flat, so it's like blowing against a sheet of plywood there's not an imbalance so it doesn't push it as you can see the only slope is up near the front so up near the front it would probably take you know a good 50 60 mile an hour wind to turn that Never mind starting to be able to produce energy in uh, light wind. It isn't turning at all. As you can see. Yeah, look at that. She's starting to go now. Like right now we're out in about 30 kilometer, kilometer an hour winds with gusts up to 45 and 50 kilometers an hour. As you can see, I could sit there all day. Now there's no load on that whatsoever. The wires are all disconnected. They're not shorted together. It's just not doing a damn thing.
Anyhow, I'm going in. My hands are getting cold. Standing out here holding this. But we got the message anyways. We can see there is wind out there. We can hear there is wind here. It's turning into the wind without any problems. The pole will actually bend back in a strong wind, but it still won't spin. I can go up there and spin it with a pole and a duster <laughs> on the end of it and it'll spin around without any problems. It's just the blade design. The blades are too flat out near the end. There's not enough taper on them to catch wind and start turning it. Still not doing a damn thing. <laughs> you can see that the trees are moving. Now those trees are way up there. Right in at the level that I'm at, there's a lot of wind coming through in between the trees more than enough wind to be able to turn and rotate that at least a little bit. 